This tiny diamond-shaped battery has the potential to revolutionize the way we think about energy and can potentially solve many of the world's energy problems. So, if you're interested in renewable energy, the future of technology, or just want to learn about something cool and new, then this is the video for you. Welcome to the channel. Please smash the like and subscribe buttons and turn on the post notification bell so you do not miss out on future videos like this. Today, we're going to be talking about a new and revolutionary technology that has just hit the market, the nuclear diamond battery. So without further ado, let's get started. As our world becomes more and more reliant on technology and digital devices, the demand for effective and efficient batteries continues to grow. The lithium ion batteries that currently power much of this technology have their limitations, including sensitivity, high costs, and a relatively short lifespan. They also hurt the environment when they are disposed of. To meet the increasing demand for batteries and address these issues, scientists are working on developing a new type of battery called a nuclear diamond battery. The nuclear diamond battery. The nuclear diamond battery is a small diamond-shaped device that generates electricity from radiation. It uses a process called radioisotope thermophotovoltaics to convert the energy from a radioactive material into electricity. The battery itself is made of a small piece of diamond, which is coated with a thin layer of a radioactive material. When the radioactive material decays, it emits energy in the form of radiation, which is then absorbed by the diamond. The energy is then converted into electricity, which can be used to power devices or charge batteries. This innovative technology harnesses the energy produced by the radioactive decay of carbon-14, a naturally occurring isotope found in all living things. By encasing carbon-14 in a diamond matrix, scientists have found a way to generate electricity from this energy. The nuclear diamond battery has the potential to operate for thousands of years, significantly reducing the need for battery replacement and the associated costs and environmental impact. In addition to their long lifespan, nuclear diamond batteries are also highly efficient. They have a high energy density, meaning that they can store a lot of energy in a small space. This makes them suitable for a wide range of applications, from small devices like smartphones and laptops to larger ones like electric vehicles. Another advantage is that the nuclear diamond battery is incredibly small and lightweight, making it ideal for use in small electronic devices or for applications where weight is a major concern. And because it generates electricity from radiation, it doesn't require any external energy source, making it completely self-sufficient. The production of nuclear diamond batteries also has a lower environmental impact compared to traditional batteries. This is because the carbon-14 used in these batteries is already present in the environment, rather than requiring the mining and processing of raw materials. While the nuclear diamond battery is still in the early stages of development, it has the potential to revolutionize the way we power our devices and address some of the limitations of traditional batteries. Its long lifespan, high efficiency, and low environmental impact make it an attractive alternative to traditional battery technologies and it could play a significant role in the transition to a more sustainable and efficient energy system. These all begs the question, how did it all begin? Dr. Tom Scott, a materials engineering professor at the University of Bristol, has spent a significant amount of time researching for and on behalf of the nuclear industry. He is the technical director of Imitech LUD, a company specialized in detecting and mapping radioactive materials in various settings. In his talk, Diamonds Are Forever, Dr. Scott proposed a solution to two problems, the disposal of radioactive graphite in spent nuclear fuel, SNF, and the need for a long-lasting source of constant energy. Dr. Scott suggested extracting radioactive C14, a byproduct of nuclear fission, from the surface of graphite blocks, and using it to create deliberately radioactive diamonds, these diamonds, when encapsulated inside an artificial diamond, could be used to create a nuclear-powered battery for a long-term supply of clean energy. This technique was first demonstrated by researchers in 2016, when they grew a man-made radioactive diamond in a laboratory and placed it in a radioactive field to generate a small electric current. 
In addition to addressing the need for a long-lasting source of energy, extracting radioactive C-14 can also provide a practical solution to the problem of nuclear waste disposal. Scientists at the UK Atomic Energy Authority's Hydrogen-3 Advanced Technology Facility are currently working on a pilot project to establish a production line for these batteries, with the initial goal of producing up to 20,000 devices per year, powering the future with nuclear batteries. These innovative devices use energy from the decay of radioactive isotopes to generate electric current and differ from nuclear reactors as they do not rely on a chain reaction to produce power. Nuclear batteries have a higher volumetric energy density than chemical batteries, which means they can store more energy in a given volume and have longer battery life. They are also able to withstand harsh conditions better than chemical batteries. The nuclear diamond battery has a wide range of potential applications, and it could potentially be used in a variety of industries and sectors. Here are just a few of the ways it could be used. 1. Space Exploration One of the biggest potential uses for the nuclear diamond battery is in space exploration. It could be used to power satellites, probes, and other space-based instruments, as it doesn't require any external energy source and can potentially last for thousands of years. 2. Military The military could also use nuclear diamond batteries to power a variety of devices, including drones, communication equipment, and other electronic devices. It could be especially useful in situations where access to external power sources is limited or not possible. 3. Medical Nuclear batteries have also been used in implantable medical devices, IMDs, that need to function over a long period without being accessed for recharge or maintenance. These batteries, known as beta-voltaic cells, were widely used in IMDs during the 1970s. However, concerns about the potential risk of radiation led to the shift towards lithium-ion batteries in the 1980s. With recent advancements in nuclear battery technology, the use of beta-voltaic cells is being re-evaluated as a potential power source for IMDs. 4. Remote Locations The nuclear diamond battery could be used in remote locations where access to traditional power sources is limited or non-existent. It could be used to power electronic devices in remote villages, for example, or to provide electricity to off-grid homes. 5. Environmental Monitoring The nuclear diamond battery could also be used in environmental monitoring devices, such as sensors or monitoring stations. Its small size and long lifespan would make it ideal for use in these types of applications. As the demand for long-lasting, efficient, and reliable power sources continues to grow, nuclear batteries have the potential to play a significant role in powering the future. Challenges and Criticisms While the nuclear diamond battery has a lot of potentials, it's not without its challenges and criticisms. One of the main criticisms is that it relies on radioactive materials, which some people are understandably concerned about. The radioactive material used in the nuclear diamond battery is typically a low-level radioactive material, which means it has a relatively low level of radiation and is considered safe for use. However, there are still concerns about the potential risks of using radioactive materials in any application, including the potential for leaks or accidents. There are also concerns about the cost of producing nuclear diamond batteries as the materials and technology involved are currently quite expensive. While the cost is expected to decrease as production scales up, it may still be a barrier to widespread adoption in the near term. Conclusion Despite these challenges, the nuclear diamond battery has the potential to revolutionize the way we think about energy and could potentially solve many of the world's energy problems. Its almost unlimited lifespan, small size, and self-sufficiency make it an appealing alternative to traditional batteries, and it has a wide range of potential applications. While there are still challenges and criticisms to be addressed, the future looks bright for this innovative technology. It will be interesting to see how it develops and what new and exciting applications it will be used for in the coming years. Thanks for watching, and if you found this video interesting, don't forget to like and subscribe for more great content like this.